I'll teach you how to find your top selling products in Google Analytics 4, be that by product name or SKU number. <laughs> Hello data people, my name is Robert and I'm here to help you understand and analyze data to make better decisions in e-commerce. So let's head to the GA4 dashboard. So I'm here in my GA4 and I need to get to reports and from here I need to find monetization. In yours it might be called slightly differently but usually it's monetization and under monetization you have e-commerce purchases again it might be slightly different uh, with a slightly different name here but basically this is what you should see you should see first these two graphs here and then you have this table with the product names here right now it's sorted by the item items viewed so the most viewed items and this is the product page views but you can also sort it by items purchased so now you would see the top sellers on your website for some businesses it makes also sense to look at the SKU number and you can change from here from item name to item id and in this case you would see the SKU number for it if you need to know what products are sold together the most click on the this banner up on top here and it'll take you to a tutorial on top of that you can do this same stuff as with pretty much all the reports in j4 you can change the days from here you can also compare uh, different segments so if you want comparison you can add comparison from here and you could also add filters here if you have something specific like for example let's click on filter and we want to look at certain campaign we can just come here session campaign and we just add exactly matches and you can choose the campaign here or you can also start typing for example may uh, however, if I choose this one, it's not going to show anything right now because I'm in February, March, and this is a May campaign. But I want to just show you there's a button here, apply. And once you apply, that filter gets added and you're able to see data for it. By the way, data is not created equal and you should be only looking at data that is relevant to your role. That's why I've created a cheat sheet which shows you uh, just the most important metrics and KPIs specific to different e-commerce roles. You can download it by clicking on the link in the description. Now you know where to find the top selling products, but GA4 default reports are full of metrics and dimensions you don't need and using them will just waste your time. That's why you should watch this video next if you want to learn the most useful reports in GA4.